morning everyone. It's quarter past seven in the morning and I've literally just got out the tent so sorry if I'm a bit blurry. So it rained a little bit last night although right now the sky, I'm just going to turn you around, there is parts of blue in the sky and I've checked the weather forecast and it's going to rain later on this afternoon and I'm kind of in a situation where I don't know if I should leave today or leave tomorrow. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do is just have some breakfast, uh, get my stuff ready and then make a decision sort of around nine o'clock when I'm due to leave, check the weather forecast again and then make my mind up then. So I'll catch you guys in a bit. Hi guys, so an hour and 20 into the day and 20 kilometers done. And it's a bit difficult to know what the weather's going to do right now. Uh, I can see blue sky in front of me but the wind's blowing quite strongly and within 10 minutes that blue sky changes to like overcast and then it changes again. I think eventually I'm going to get rained on but so far so good, no worries. And I'm at a rest stop place again as you can see, which I find quite handy. In fact this place would be quite nice to wild camp but it's right next to a busy road so maybe not uh, not very stealth like. Uh, anything else to say from notes from the road? Not really, I've just passed through the town of Vouziers. Again, my, my French accent is just wonderful, isn't it? And uh, yeah, that's it. So it's just a matter of uh, having a quick break now and then carrying on. Cheers. Oh man, that was like the worst place to get hit by the rain. So I'm cycling uphill. <coughs> Excuse me. Cycling uphill is pretty steep, really super strong headwind comes in, bringing with it some rain. There's no shelter anywhere, nothing I can do, so I'm soaked. Well, the top of me is alright because of the jacket, but my shorts are soaked. On the other hand, they could do with the wash, as I haven't been washed for a couple of weeks. Still not like to do about it, you just got to carry on really. Uh, that said, if the rest of the day is going to, if there's more in store for the rest of the day, uh, I think instead of going for the 100 kilometer, if there's a campsite around 50 kilometer and onwards, I'll probably just dive in and treat it as fair game. But we'll see how, what goes on. I'm sure the wind is going to dry me quite thoroughly. Anyway, hi there. So I'm taking a quick break underneath this tree. It's two hours 35 into the journey and I've done about 32 kilometers. No, it must be more than that. Let me, go, let me have a look for you. Let me get the exact figure. I know that you're into that stuff. 37 kilometers. And I am taking a shelter in this underneath a tree where, I don't know, it looks like people have taken shelter under this tree for many years. Let's have a look. So there's a cross there and that stone looks like it's probably got some history as well. So I'm just going to take five. Uh, yeah, the weather's going to be a bit changeable all day, as I said, uh, the wind's blowing quite strongly. Uh, every now and again there, there'll be a clear bit of sky, but then the rain clouds will come in. Uh, so I'm just hoping that there's a campground well, any time onwards would, would make me happy. turned into an awesome day. The rain I was expecting, the hail was a bit of a surprise. Ouch. So I found a barn just to take some quick shelter. A little bit too late I think. And when it passes over I shall start off again. So I managed to find a campground around the 70 kilometer mark at a place called Guigny Port, which I know is not how to pronounce it, but I don't know how to pronounce it, so there we go. Um, it rained on and off all day, and it's raining a bit now. Uh, tomorrow is also Bastille Day, which is a holiday. So tomorrow, whether or not I leave here, um, will come down to the weather and ah, what I feel like, I guess. So I guess the, the shops will be closed tomorrow. Not that it makes much difference because there's not many shops along the road anyway. Um, so yeah, I'll just see what, to, what tomorrow holds before I leave off. Thanks for watching, thumbs up, subscribe, all that jazz. Speak to you later guys, cheers for now.